My sister was actually a big sister back when I was in high school, and it's always been something I've wanted to do. Every week, that's right. Yep. Joe Salvo and CJ spend a few hours. You name it, we've we've kind of done it. Just having. I like get to go places that I've never been before. Fun. When we're together, it's the best time. <laughs> big brothers, big sisters of Middle Tennessee matched the pair after CJ's mother decided the 11-year-old needed a male influence in his life. His schooling wasn't as fair. You know, his grades were down. He had some times where, you know, you could tell he needed some additional love other than mom's love. Big Brothers Big Sisters of Middle Tennessee has been matching children with bigs for years. What we know is when the child does better, the family does better. But recently, the organization has expanded the work it does with the help of a partnership with the Tennessee Department of Human Services. We've started to facilitate programs that involve the parents. All right. We know that many of the young people that are in our program have or have been a victim of a crime. All right. They are at risk of being bullied. Um, they have had some trauma in their life, and so we have had training programs for parents. Boom! CJ's mom says the extra help has made her a better mother. Honestly, if I ask for anything, they help me. Can you reach it? While the program itself has made a big difference. He teaches me a lot about his life and stuff. For a boy who try, won't be little. Try to uh, keep my anger problems in control much longer. He has not been the same since. CJ loves Joe. That's all you hear him talk about. Grades have came up. His academic skills is just everything. He's learning how to cook. Joe teaches him everything. He's kind of the, the male figure in his household and he kind of just needs that mentorship and someone to look up to. Let's go get some pizza. I'm thankful for Joe. I really am thankful for Joe.